But what if you had a perfectly natural dialogue with a computer? Wouldn't that be like talking to another human being? If you could have a perfectly natural dialogue, it's a very big if. A typical attempt to get a computer to simulate a real conversation is a program called ELIZA. There's a simplified version of it on the pet. Please tell me your problem. What's this all about? ELIZA simulates the sort of conversation that you might have with a psychiatrist. Pretend that you have some psychiatric problem. Type it in and see what happens. I'm depressed. My daughter left home. Okay. Please go on. Well, I certainly don't want her to get into trouble. What would it mean to you if she gets into trouble? Well, wouldn't you worry? You're just a dumb machine anyway. And I'm going to tell you so in your own language. Do computers frighten you? You know, that's really incredible. It's as if it really understood what I was saying. But it doesn't, of course. It's just a bag of tricks. It has a lot of canned phrases such as, please tell me your problem, tell me more, please go on. It's programmed to throw these out from time to time. Yeah, but it seemed more than just random. If you start a sentence with, I am, it might turn it around with, how long have you been? But it doesn't really understand any of this conversation. Type in some nonsense and you'll see. All right. Tell me more about... Oh, I get it. It hasn't the faintest idea what I'm talking about. 